Attacks launched by Boko Haram with the use of improvised explosives is a threat that must be addressed by modern technology. To tackle this challenge, the chief of army staff inaugurated the Nigerian Army Vehicle Manufacturing Company. The aim was to produce indigenous armored fighting vehicles using 70% local content. This laid to the foundation of the production of the Ezugu Mine Resistant Ambush Protected Vehicles, MRAP, in Rigachuku in Kaduna State. The establishment of the Army's official corps, the Army Cyber Warfare Command, 50 Space Command, and the Land Forces Simulation Center are laudable efforts at repositioning the Army to address emerging and future stress to our national security. Six months later, President Mamadou Buhari is at the Chief of Army Staff Conference in Kaduna to induct the indigenous MRAPs into combat. The Ezogo MRAP that we just launched is so cheap, equivalent of about 10 imported ones, and is very effective. Not only creating employment for the people, because I understand it's 100% locally manufactured. So that gives jobs to our youths, engineers and the like. In his address, the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Tuku Brotai, said the Nigerian Army has introduced new strategies to change the game and achieve success in the theater of operations. The presidential directive was to involve a professional, well-respected, highly motivated and people-centric Nigerian Army that will have the requisite capability and capacity to respond adequately in a timely manner to solve the myriad of contemporary and future security threats. President Mamadou Buhari also commissioned the upgraded 44 Nigerian Reference Hospital. The annual conference is an assembly of principal staff officers, corps and operation commanders geared towards reviewing the Army's activities and planning for operations in the coming year. Ihotu Odo, AIT News, Kaduna.